Okay, I'm, this is again unrehearsed, but I'm going to try and show you that it's, that's the moon out there. Uh, this is uh, Monday morning, November 22nd, I think. I'm going to bring this thing down and pan around. I'll show you where I'm at. Let it autofocus. Well, bring the focus at your home. Focus. Well, it's going to focus eventually. Pan this thing around. Maybe if I put my hand in front of it, it'll focus. Let's see if I put my hand in front of this thing, it'll focus. Oh, there it goes. Great. I'm sure that you all have started with one of these little... T well, first of all, let me give you a little history briefly. I'm trying to keep this short. Here, and with a beam shot, if you will. Okay. Oh, uh, darn. Too many things in my hands. Okay. Here is a uh, standard old 2D flashlight. And... Uh, Damn, I need to pan this thing down. Uh, running out of hands. Okay, there we go. There is... See that in the camera? Yeah. There is a 2D flashlight for brightness, okay? Right, let me throw that to the ground. All right. Now, next is a... Here's a... Four, where is it? Here's a 4D... Uh, 3-watt LED... Mag light. Let's throw that down. Okay. And then here, like I started with to get the thing focusing, here is that little toy here. I'm sure a lot of you have, have tried to put a uh, flashlight on your bicycle with. And then here is a two, uh, a two AA mag light, which I modified with a one watt uh, with a one watt. Uh, LED bulb in it. Anyway, there's a beam shot for that. This is on the grass, by the way, okay? Now, we reach down here and get the next selection of flashlights. Let's see, let's start with this one here, I guess. I don't know, that doesn't order. Okay. Uh, I started with uh, one of these here, which is a uh, Solar Force uh, L603, I think it is. It takes four, whatever. And, um, it uh, would fit into this toy, and if I turn it on, give you a beam shot. Whoop, there we go. That's what the beam shot looks like for that, okay? And then, let's throw that down. And then, uh, and then here is the next one I went up to, which is a, uh, what is this thing? This is a solar, where is it? Solar Force uh, L900, okay? And here is the beam shot for it. That's pretty bright. I like that. But, anyhow. Okay, so much for that. Then, throw that down. Well, there it stayed on. Darn. <laughs> okay. Then, then we went to a, uh, oh, don't get me lying here. It's a SST50 something or other. Unique fire. There we go. And that's the beam shot for it. Okay, and then, uh, then I got this here, this uh, great big monstrosity type thing, which is much bigger than that, and it's got a beam shot of like that. And let me pan around to the bicycle here. All right. And uh, oh, let me turn. That's what I was going to do. I was going to show you the um, focus this on the uh, what is that? The manhole cover right there. I'm going to turn the uh, cat eye on. Can you see the cat eye? I can't. Then here's the, uh, that thing there. Rotate it down. See that there? That's the, uh, LED P7 Yada. And then, uh, here, I'm just going to ride this, uh, just going to ride this thing. Let's see, uh, I can throw this up against the, uh, that's what the uh, SST50 looks like in comparison over there and uh, 
then here's the uh, L, the uh, here's the what is this thing? The uh, I don't know. Anyway, and then here's the really long one. It looks like that. Okay. And I'm just going to ride this thing down the road here. Let you see the tail lights of this bike. Hopefully, I won't be too boring for you. There goes the truck. I'm going to ride it down to the little turnaround thing and then come back and turn this thing off and we'll head for home. Did it for me.